It's Wednesday, June 2nd. I'm Mark Kelly with your news to go. So the health department and the Palm Beach County School District could soon be working together to help vaccinate children. Today, school board members are scheduled to vote on a partnership that would open four mobile vaccine sites for anyone 12 and older. Now the shots would start sometime this month in June. Now the proposed locations are up on the screen now, and if this passes this week, the agreement would last through June of 2022 and could even be extended further. Also today, you can head to Clover Park in Port St. Lucie for the Olympic qualifier baseball games, and while you're there, you can get a COVID shot too. The Department of Health in St. Lucie County, they have a tent set up on the west side of the ballpark, and they're going to be administering the Johnson & Johnson vaccine between 3 and 7 this afternoon. And about 300 doses will be available. You don't have to make an appointment either. Now, anyone who gets the shot, you're also going to get a $10 gift voucher to buy some groceries. And remember, baseball fans can slide up to Palm Beach County's mobile vaccination clinic right there at the ballpark of the Palm Beaches this week as well. Teams will be competing for the qualifier games there for the Tokyo Olympics, and they are also going to have a walk up vaccine site open, ready to go today and Friday from noon to three and then again from six to nine in the evening. Now, doses of both the Pfizer and the Johnson and Johnson vaccine will be available at that site. Sandra. Right, good stuff. Thanks a lot. And as we take a look at your first morning forecast, we're going to see a chance of some rain today. We need the rain. We had some showers earlier this morning. We have about a 20 to 40% chance, depending on your time period, of seeing more downpours at some point this afternoon. So make sure you're equipped with the umbrella. Highs in the mid to upper 80s.